Hello guys, and welcome to episode, uh, what is this, 46, and it is in fact 46, um, okay, so, because I actually looked at that this time, so yeah, um, I'm on, um, I, look at me, I am on the ball, <laughs> alright, so, uh, few things of change to note, one, giant ass hallway, two, light stone in the walls, and three is uh, our little library's back in action. Alright, um, a few other things. I have done some improvements around the, around the, I don't know, I guess what you call this, a shack? <laughs> um, couple of improvements. I have extended the ceiling here, made this too wide, as well as made this too wide, um, well, two blocks, that is, not, like, too wide as in, it's too wide, <laughs> whatever. I made this area a huge, huge difference. It is very, very large now. Um, mind you, I did use a lot of my wood. Um, the main reason for me doing this, I also decided to make some coal out of the wood, so I'm broke on wood again. Looks like it's time to go back and work on that treehouse. <laughs> Alright, so here's the thing. Um, well, not the thing. Here is this episode's content. This is what we're going to be talking about. The uh, We are going to be talking about the latest and greatest snapshot of the Minecraft uh, world. This will be featured in uh, Minecraft 1.3 which is, of course, going to be the newest update. There are snapshots that are out already, so you guys can go download that. However, there is um, there is one thing that you guys uh, may not want to download this, and I will get into that later. But, um, oh, and I also decided I went out Ender Pearl Enderman hunting, so I have uh, Ender Pearls. Now we just got to figure out how to make them into Ender Eyes of Ender, which I know how to do, but I won't do that right now. Um, and we will... Uh, Finally, you have our chances at going out after the that thing. Okay, so first uh, first order of business is the uh, what is it? That place, that place, that thing, that uh, uh, what's it called? The update 1.3. Right. So in the snapshot, latest and greatest snapshot is uh, villagers. May huge portion on villagers. Now, Jeb has promised us this, and he has certainly delivered. Villagers will now trade items. Of course, the, 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 the current prices set are very, very cheap, so we look to see that to change in the future. Um, he has added a currency item, which uh, everyone is already guessing that uh, that is going to be the new, um, the new uh, block, which is uh, emeralds. Right, so you can now mine emeralds as a piece of currency in Minecraft that you will be able to buy uh, items with. Right, you can also turn emeralds into emeralds blocks. However, there's currently a glitch where uh, emeralds do not have the right texture pack. So, of course, this kind of takes away from the game uh, currently. However, these are bugs that will be fixed, and that is why the recent, most recent update or this snapshot is not actually fully out for Minecraft. Okay. So, um, here is the next order of business. Um, the, let's see, the, uh, he has, uh, integrated a few minor terrain changes, probably smoother, uh, smoother lighting, or, uh, smoother, um, smoother biome changes rather than, uh, giant drop-offs. Maybe there's, uh, there's a little creek dividing them. However, there was that before, but it was not in excess. Oh, God, that is a lot of water. Um, let's see, what else can we get out here? Uh, yeah. no, please don't put out my lights. Okay, never mind. Alright, so, yeah, we have, uh, we have that, too. Let's see, um, okay, there are going to be new useful blocks. Okay, so these are going to be created, uh, mostly out of obsidian. There are going to be a few, uh, few different uh, different kinds of blocks and more useful blocks. This could be uh, different changes that he has promised us in the past. I cannot uh, put my finger on any of them at the moment. However, um, I'm sure that they are, well, they say useful, so pff, obviously they're going to be uh, a lot better than what we uh, what we currently have now and maybe help us out a little bit. 
Um, next change is the uh, he added a seed command. This is probably uh, for multiplayer, uh, most likely, unless you have single player commands on, or he is going to integrate single player commands into the game uh, already, which is, would be quite nice because uh, I know a lot, me and my friends we love using uh, using all the commands and uh, different kinds of stuff. So yeah, he is going. To, he's integrating a seed command. So show your seed, okay? show your seed. Uh, another thing uh, that is in this snapshot is uh, sandstone, sandstone stairs. Blah. Okay, so uh, basically this is going to be uh, another add-on to the stairs uh, collection. Of course these stairs can be uh, put upside down like all the other ones and this time they're just going to be made out of sandstone so you can make, uh, you know, um, a whole bunch of uh, different creations and it'll match like a desert theme, I guess. All right. Um, the next one, uh, a bunch of small changes, bug fixes to the current uh, the current Minecraft that is out, which is uh, this one right here, which is like 1.2.5. Uh, don't quote me on that because I'm not quite sure. I think it is still uh, 1.2.5. However, um, if I am wrong, I do apologize, but whatever. Um, okay. So of course. Of course, there are going to be bug fixes, always bug fixes. Um, currently, I haven't actually seen a lot of bugs in the, in this version, so actually I'm quite happy about that. But uh, I still remember like the days when we had, uh, what's it called, the Minecraft, uh, the major bug where you would uh, open up your chest and if you had a bucket of water in your hands, it would spill out everywhere and it would just make a mess. Nobody really enjoyed that, but uh, they did get rid of it, so I'm sure that any bugs that you guys have found, uh, they are going to be fixed in this update. And then, of course, new bugs will arise because it's going to be a new update. Alright, a uh, few other things that I would like to... Uh, go over is possible plans for the future and or plans that may be, uh, may actually involve the current update uh, because they are already of course uh, working on it so the the things that are going to be possibly uh, in the new update are going to be uh, possible TNT traps in the world this is uh, basically uh, like the TNT mine that you guys can look up on YouTube maybe I'll do a video on it uh, different TNT, like hit a switch, it blows up, or whatever. Um, this, uh, th these will be uh, now in part of the as part of the world, so people won't be making them, but they will be uh, randomly. So yeah, just uh, <laughs> watch out. So okay, the next uh, the next thing is going to be. Uh, oh, this is interesting. This is actually uh, Ender Chest. This is going to be sort of like a chest, but it will be uh, found in like the Nether or the Ender World, and this uh, this will actually uh, allow you to uh, pick up uh, items. So I'm guessing there's going to be like Nether, um, Nether, what's it called? Uh, whatever those things were that I found down there uh, with the green mossy stuff. Uh, I can't remember what it's called at the moment. I don't know why. It's uh, it's a mob. Mobs, I don't know, something or other. But uh, yeah, there could be possibly those in uh, in a future update. So stay tuned for that as well. Okay, so uh, another thing, uh, there will be, of course, I have, uh, as I have uh, told you before, is that uh, emerald emerald ore is going to be integrated into the game. Um, oh, hello. Okay, so with this emerald ore, there will be, uh, of course, money and other stuff. Um, what else is there? There's going to also be... Um, ooh, this is interesting. Buckets are going to be stackable. Well, what do you know? Tired of carrying, uh, like, nine buckets around trying to get water? Well, guess what? Now you can just have uh, a block of 64 buckets, and you can go fill up as many buckets of water as you want. Not sure how this is going to work, though, with the the whole, once you fill a bucket, it becomes a new block sort of thing. Um, but, yeah, it, it'll definitely be interesting to see if it works. Definitely very, very useful, um, especially for me, because, you know, if you want to like build certain things and they need water and you don't want to go running back and forth. This will also allow you to carry multiple buckets and go collect lots of lava. However, um, I'm not sure how it's helping the griefing situation if people can just carry, uh, you know, 30 buckets of lava around or 100 buckets of lava around wherever the hell they go and they can go and grief. But, uh, you know, I'm sure there'll be some um, 
some different mod that'll ban these in the in the in the later episodes. Okay, so other things that should be mentioned at the moment. Um, let's see. Uh, stairs are stars are going to be more realistic. So if you guys actually look up at the night sky, which I'm not outside at the moment, but if you guys look up at the night sky, they're actually just uh, square blocks. All right, now um, star stars, of course, uh, are always going to be square blocks. However, uh, if you you can, guys can get mods that will turn the sun and the moon into circles, uh, the stars will probably also be circles. However, um, if he's going to make stars more realistic, I'm guessing there's going to be a slight twinkle to them, or they will be uh, circular or something like that. I'm not quite sure, but uh, yeah. Um, let's see, he added pyramids into the desert biomes, may add pyramids into the desert biomes. Again, this is just some points of interest that have already been discussed and may possibly be in the new update. So, um, yeah. So this will be, uh, a bunch of, a bunch of, uh, pyramids, which will actually be nice, because that means the one that I am building is kind of going to be useless. So, whatever. Um... Let's see what else. Dispensers will eject water and lava as well as be able to uh, bring them back in. And these are source blocks. These are not just lava and water uh, water spawn blocks. So these are actual source blocks the dispenser is going to be uh, dispensing and uh, sucking back in, which uh, is actually quite useful. It leaves a bunch of opens, a bunch of openings for our redstone uh, users. That'll be uh, that'll be quite interesting to see how they um, how they incorporate all this. Uh, all this new material into our, into all of our uh, new everyday Minecraft. So, let's uh, without further ado, let's uh, let's go down to some current bugs that are in the uh, that are in the the thing. So first, uh, as I've mentioned previously, the uh, what's it called? The bah. Ah, oh, what's it called? Emerald ore has the wrong texture, right? So, uh, it uh, the emerald's uh, not currently working, so if you guys do download this, your emerald is not going to look like emerald at all. And as far as I know, it is uh, only hackable. I am not 100% uh, sure that... Uh, well, I am 100% sure that within the new update it will uh, be an actual block that you may collect or you get from selling um, stuff. I'm not sure if it'll be an ore just yet, but we will wait and see. Um, generated structures are going to be very buggy in this, uh, if you guys download the snapshot. Uh, if you guys load a preview, here's very important, this is the thing that I was talking about at the beginning of the video. Very important, if you, down, if you load a world from a previous version, there is a very high, like 95% chance that that world will be corrupt. All right, just a heads up so nobody gets mad at me for referring them to this. So you guys will have to start a new world because or um use MC edit and get your uh copy and paste your world out from your where it is currently and put it in uh another world right in uh, the new updated version right however i do not know if this bug is going to be fixed by the next time so wait for me to give you the okay on playing your old worlds okay um, let's see, what else is there? Uh, uh, stacked buckets, of course, at the moment. Ooh, actually, this is interesting. It says, uh, that bugs, stacked buckets, uh, do not pick up water. Well, this is interesting. This means that they have already integrated, uh, stacking buckets into the, into the game. Therefore, you guys will be able to see stacked buckets. Alright. Um, let's see, another, another, uh, another good point. What is another good point? Um, uh, there's a new golden apple. Let's see, let's read on. It does not require, oh, it does not appear in creative mode. Oh, genius. Um, doy, I remember a few friends telling me this at school. Now, don't, <laughs> I do trust my friends. However, uh, don't take this, uh, as a giant, um, giant head f uh, heads forward, but you know this mod, TMI? Well, basically, you are going to have this mod. Well, not entirely. Basically, what you're going to do is you're going to have this little button right here. This creative mode is off, creative mode is on. You're going to have this button that's going to be able to swap you from survival to creative mode 
uh, when you hit open your inventory. So that is a um, a great feature. It means people don't have to download TMI anymore, which basically means that yeah, they're going out of business. <laughs> well, to say to say uh, to say the least, you know, they could. Um, they could very well uh, find a new way to integrate whatever they're doing into the new uh, Minecraft. However, they're seeing as uh, you can just swap to Creative Mode. I see very little point in uh, in downloading TMI anymore, other than the fact that you may now you can uh, you know change it from night and day and change your difficulty mid game, right? Uh, mind you, you can change your difficulty mid game anyway. So the only thing they got really got going for them is uh, night and day. So yeah. Anyway. Uh, that I do believe is the going to be the end of our uh, episode 46. Uh, hope I guys hope I gave you guys a ton of information because man oh man this is going to be a nice large update that is going to fix a bunch of bugs and bring us a lot new content. So guys, without any further ado, I uh, I will see you guys next week for the latest episode of my Minecraft Let's Play. So. See you then.